posing gloves here and today we are looking at a new VST. This is called Capsule by Sound Slate. It's kind of like Arcade in that it is a bunch of sounds. You're given some controls over each of those sounds right here. And you know, we could we could play them. But it's a library as well. You can go and you can download the patches that you want. And there's different collections. So right now this is monochrome, so you know monophonic synth kind of stuff but they've got some stuff here they've got like orchestral piano type stuff for example we could come in here i've got one downloaded for this one these are these are quite big you can see some of these are 438 megabytes it's huge and then we'll go over to the play we'll, we'll bring that delay down put it a little bit more reasonable like if you've ever opened contact and you've ever thought to yourself i wish i could just have the patch i use instead of having to pay for the entire thing and that's kind of what uh, this is doing so we've got here you know pianos let's just go through some of the the variety here let's just do a bunch of playing through so we've got here some violin type stuff uh let's let's select some sound <laughs> I don't know what I was going for there, but I went there. Uh, let's go to the play. So once you select an area, you can actually just come in here or use the arrows, which is pretty nice. You've got your microphone position, and there's two additional menus. You'll always see, you'll see the piano keyboard. So if you don't have one set up, and you've also got some behavior stuff. So that monophonic library, you can actually make it polyphonic right in here. Uh, I'm going to just focus on just the bass patches because that's what you're probably going to use if you do decide to pick this up. See, so there's some really nice stuff. Let's pump the hall mic up. Now let's go ahead and bring it down. So you get a closer, more intimate sound. Really high quality stuff too. Um, I don't know what it is, but I'm so used to buying libraries that are all focused on, you know, that one thing, really high quality libraries. So hearing just a single patch with a hall mic that sounds really nice, uh, it's just kind of like, man, I wish I'd had this when I was just getting started. Way more affordable. Uh, let's go for now they have some sustain and velocity stuff let's go for sustain patch Beautiful, wonderful. Let's move over to some other areas just to give you a good vibe for everything that's in here. So we've got some old vintage sounding stuff. Let's dig through a few of these. They've got beautiful pictures. This is monophonic. Let's go ahead and change this to polyphonic. Cool beans. Let's continue on our way.
That was Blue Order. Boiled Effects. That's the name. And they've got a tonal knob. So you'll notice that these change with every patch. So they've been made for each individual patch. Tonal. Crazy sounds. Boeing bass. I wanted to say brass there. Dunk. What a name. Get sort of more of a kick sound out of it. Let's continue through. So this is sort of like these ones are kind of like hybrid orchestral-ish patches, but with a lot of other influences. And you've got like the ability to add tags. I'm sure this is going to increase. Uh, in the short time that I've been working with Capsule, uh, I have already noticed e they even update like the libraries themselves. We get new patches. <laughs> Let's go for boss level. Show me what that's about. All right, let's go for all pad. Here's bass. Let's turn the tremolo off. It's got like an old video game vibe to it for sure. Let's try some higher notes. That was Bouncing Strings Chamber String Machine and the Sensual Pulse. Now, is there a way? Because some of these sounds have things built into them. Let's take the pulse out. Take the piss. Holy cow, so low. There's a little thing at the end on that one. Sometimes it's not hold down my notes, right? Well, 
that's a mood right there. Let's continue forward. <laughs> Uh, real quick, just so you know, when you when you open it the first time, you get greeted with some lovely uh, sawtooth waveforms. Uh, but let's go ahead and press on. Let's go through some black ivory. Now these, some of these have more sound design than others, so maybe I'll filter it with acoustic. Oh, it appears there's no acoustic yet. So I guess I'll just go with some of these sound design more patches. It's really nice. These are actually a wonderful sound. Really good for lo-fi for sure. Let's go for something minor. That string volume, let's bring that all the way down. Right? I really like this black ivory. Pressing on Dream of Strings. This is one I need to hook the mod bill up. Now, some that's currently a thing that I hope gets fixed in a patch. I'm actually running one patch behind for reasons. Uh, the CCs aren't consistent. So right now this controls the main wheel, the big knob I just connected it to. This is not true for every patch. It will move around and it can be a little disorienting sometimes, especially if you hook up knobs to everything. So just be aware of that for now, that's something that I've noticed. Oh, I like this. This is a... So you can favorite them. I'm going to favorite that one. That one was dope. Here's experimental. Oh. Bring up the Padify. Bring down the reverse. The echo. Well, I want to see if I can reduce that. I like this reverse thing. I guess it's just built into this particular patch. The reverse piano thing's pretty dope.
I want to resolve to C, even though it definitely doesn't want to go to C. This is like some, some creepy stuff. Let's dig through a different library. So we got like Ether. Let's check that one out. We got Airy Knights. These are all gonna have like a super thick kind of a mood to them for atmosphere. Angels and Demons. Oh, you know, they had a Chaos knob. What's, what's it with no Chaos? Then we'll add some Chaos in. Okay, uh, this is appraising chord. I don't know if any of you guys watch Felix Colgrave's animations. He's got a strong Felix Co Colgrave. You know what I mean? It's got his vibe. layer that up more space cut off up filter mix bring that down interesting that's april showers this is bent oh man that's got a really weird you're wearing headphones they did like a face flip thing or something because that's like disorienting that's kind of cool so that's ether. Let's go into Exodus a bit. Just pick something. Astral fanfare. Astral whispers. Okay, so this is monophonic. This could be a really good retro wave lead. Atlas Atmos. Another great retro. This this one seems to have a retro vibe to it. Are we on body this? There we go. upwards let's go through some more down here so we got the grapevine let's check a couple of these out and these ones we got some stringing keys so it's actually switched though I want to hear, oh, we got to hear the whirly. Very nice. Uh, let's go into the browser again. I want to string one. Uh, distance, distant memories? Sure.
Oh, I like that one. I'm going to favor that one, too. That's a cool one. Go for... We got some pads. Let's check out a pad. Pretty articulate pad. So if you hear those uh, wobbling effects, probably a tremolo. Yeah, tremolo speed. And there's a depth too, we can take that away. Synth layer. And uh, let's move on to, okay, so they've got grit. This is like a lot of 808 sort of like stuff for um, trap. Trap, hip hop, uh, that's the kind of vibe this is. So you see how before this was linked up to the main knob, and now it's controlling the ring mod. So that's what I was talking about earlier about it. Not always controlling the same thing. I've got one in here. I recall that had 808s. Here's some low notes. Oh, the pitch is all over the place. Or maybe that was just how long it took to bend down to where I was. Officially, officially dope. Oh, they're black on this one. I lost it a bit at the end there, but you got my vibe. We got some Red. That's a pretty cool. I, you know, I'm gonna like that one too. I like that one a lot. Got some pads. Lots of these uh, sort of warbly sorts of sounds. I have a feeling this will be a popular patch. <laughs> this one in particular. Got that bigger than life brass feel. Man, I like all of these. You know, this one's got some really nice bass stuff. <laughs> percussive uh, layer there. Do, 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 do. Got some string sounds. I don't know what I'm going for here. Let's check out the timbre. It's a more mellow to a more bright, aggressive sound. Uh, 
I like that one a lot too. This is the square wave pluck though, so I don't know if I'd favorite it. Slobby at the end there. We got growl. What the heck? I like this one a lot. It's got um he's a pirate vibes to it. Space horn. very nice let's go to another library so monochrome and neon let's go through a couple of those let's, let's dig through one or two here as well i'm not sure how to say this lam lamele sounds like one that should be played higher stuff anime love story i could see it i could see that being used as the patch do something something minor-ish it's a uh, f minor why not does this thing have a verb on it i feel like it should yep it does let's pump that all the way up transit down a bit okay transient up I think the transient was a good thing this is one where i think i might grab a different reverb uh because you could i could definitely get a lot out of this particular and these sorts of bell sounds can really benefit or become really lush with a good verb. All right, let's head over to monochrome and dig through a few of these. So these are all sort of monophonic deals. Controls the decay. All right, I want something to control this big one right here. So I'm gonna really quick configure a thing. this one. Oh, is my cursor frozen? That was weird. And I like it. Did I like it? Okay. It turned like white here. There should probably be some sort of like a background and make it consistent so that it's easy to tell. But I kind of like the variety too. Just some way to make it easily known because that was a bit confusing. This one's Blasto. Let's try Brutality. And uh, this is really warbly. Do I have something high that shouldn't be high? Yep. Beautiful. Let's continue on. Pray a few notes and boom, it got big. 
Uh, let's go over to Neon. And then I think we'll probably wrap it up right around here. Oh, so I guess this is how you download. So I didn't have this one downloaded. So you simply click it. It will download it for you. Do pay attention to the size. Because the size can be quite huge on some of these. That is, sounds like another thing where I have things. Things turned on that probably shouldn't be turned on as high as they are. They've got an interesting uh, percussive layer on that one. Arcade shooter. Oh, oh okay. Yep, that's an arcade shooter. Good effects patch. Man, I, I want desperately to have another lead right here. Hook this up to a lead. Just start playing on top of that. Big blue pad. Uh, big blue pad, please. Play some higher notes. A villain or something. Bouncing plastic, bouncing brass, going bass. Might it might have said brass or bass? I didn't read it fast enough. Or I read it too fast. I'm gonna get there. I'll get there. The aesthetics on this one. Oh my goodness. It's monophonic. How would this sound polyphonic? I gave it a go. I went for something. Not sure what I achieved there. Good Atmos patch. Okay, let's go. Let's go through a couple of the recital ones. Or I haven't downloaded these. These are quite big. So some of these are a lot more intense because there's just a lot more built into them. Let's go for the Thunderdome. So this one has a lot of very good uh, mood. All right, let me show you what I mean. something out of like Batman. Apocalypse. Just kind of a standard patch. I really like this one for the atmospheres though.
kind of got like a dystopian future kind of a vibe to it. So this is capsule. So this is pretty much it. So you come in, you get a bunch of cool sounds. You could try them out and you can go after the ones that you particularly like. Favorite them as you come across ones that you really dig. And I hopefully gave you a comprehensive view of all the sounds that are available. There are a ton of patches. More are always showing up. And yeah, if you have any questions about this, feel free to let me know. Subscribe and hit that bell icon for future videos and have a blessed day.